name is Jane Offeld. I've been teaching navigation on the schooner Mary Day for the last 10 years or so, doing sail training classes. And that brought me to the background of wanting also to teach the Coastwise Navigation class at Wooden Boat. About five years ago, we decided to have that class be not only just how to do the paper charts, the traditional way that navigation's been done for years, but also how to incorporate electronic navigation. So during the course of the week, we're plotting our courses, learning how to read the chart, measuring distances, looking for lines of position and lines of transit, figuring out our positions. And in a small power boat around the camp, around the waters near the school, um, plotting courses. One day we went out in the fog. It was great um, to come upon the buoy that we were looking for. The last day of the class is a culmination where we are moving into and looking at electronic navigation. And we got to sail, uh, be on the boat Gizmo, which is just full of electronic gear. I'm, I'm Ben Ellison. I used to uh, teach at Wooden Boat School and actually was a director for about five years. Uh, now I write about marine electronics and this is Gizmo, a Duffy 37 built here in Brooklyn but finished in at Covey Island Boat Works in Nova Scotia. Um, perfect boat as a test platform for electronics. It has about four or five times more electronics than a typical boat like this, but that enables me to test Garmin, Simran, Furuno, etc. side by side. Um, it has four radars, seven sonars. You see down here three uh, small size multifunction displays. Um, NMEA 2000 instruments, uh, there's two PC charting uh, uh, computers on, on the boat, and then up on the flybridge, uh, bigger MFDs network to these, um, a lot of electronics. Um, we're plotting on paper our chart, so this is our course course that we're running today, so this is just our log of what we're running so we can keep track of our speed and our heading and the distance that we're traveling and then have an estimation of time, and, but also see as the, the estimation of our time equaling the time that we get there. So we're taking in the information of a, re a relationship, a bearing of another object along our course and seeing the time that that uh, helping us give a location at this time because we have a relationship to that aid to navigation. So for five or six years now, uh, we've been using Gizmo and this test equipment for the fifth and last day of the traditional navigation course, and so we can show students what's happened in in boating the transition from paper charting to electronics. And I, I think it makes a very effective course day. They plan the route we take from Camden to back up to Wooden Boat and, and do some of that with paper charts on the boat but also see how you can build the route on, on a chart plotter or a computer charting program and see some of the add-ons like radar and sonar and how they help with the safe navigation process. And it's a really nice ride and I enjoy being associated with the school again. It's great.